What's up everybody? Welcome to another video from the Thrift Store Prepper. And again, the title alone should have uh, given you enough clue um, as to what today's video is going to be. And we're going to kind of try and keep this one short, but we're going to look at what's in my EDC or my everyday carry. Now, this is another thing that you may come across if you watch other um, Prepper channels or if you are a Prepper yourself, it's probably something that you have heard of. And as we've been doing a few bags in the, the last week, the bug out bag and the kind of humorous but hidden meaning um i need to go to the bathroom bag uh so with that theme i decided why not we'll have a week of bag videos and i'm going to show you what's in my everyday carry now at this point i will warn you there's absolutely nothing exciting in this whatsoever um it's very everyday, regular, normal guy stuff, and by no means any kind of Bear grills, MacGyver, or any other type shit like that in there. And without well, further ado, let's take a little look at it. So as you can see here, it's a very, very small, compact Adidas um, bag. And Adidas, if you happen to know anything about football casual culture, um, is a brand of choice, but that's not something we're going to go into. So it's very, very small. And basically the purpose of this is that I keep everything in here that I'm going to most likely need on a daily basis. And by that, the stuff I need to take to and from work. And there's nothing very exciting at all. Um, I work maybe a 20 minute bus ride, which is split between uh, halfway on a streetcar and then change out of subway in a chain station and get a bus the rest of the way. And if the schedules and buses and traffic are kind, I can do it in 20 minutes. Sometimes if it's after dark when I'm getting off work at two o'clock in the morning, sometimes on a Friday or Saturday night, then the buses do not run so frequently and neither do the streetcars. And that time can take up to an hour. And at that point, it's actually quicker for me to walk. I have walked it a couple of times on 45 minutes. So really and truly, unless it's some very, very major global effective disaster scene then it's unlikely that i'm not going to be able to make my way home it may take a little bit of time if uh, we are in some city-wide disaster um but if the power's out or anything like that i can just walk it's not so pleasant in minus 30 or minus 40 conditions but you know during the summer and warmer months it's it's a pleasurable walk and i have some nice views on the way so that being said, the reason that I don't have very much in my EDC is that I don't have far to go. I haven't got much to survive and really and truly it's going to take something pretty major to, to prevent me from getting home. So we're going to look in the front pouch here and this is nothing very exciting at all. This is just where I keep my bus fare. And as you can see, I use one of my weed baggies for a change purse for want of another word I guess and this is where I keep my bus fare and the other purpose of this is for any reason I may find myself being mugged and I can pull this out of my bag and say this is all that I have on me it might discourage the mugger into thinking that I'm a bit shit and don't have much to go uh, you know, not really worth their time to mug is what I'm trying to say. If I'm using a weed baggie with a couple of coins in it, at the moment I've got two dollars and ten cents in there. Um, so that's all that goes in the front here, and that's because it's the most um, easy and accessible pocket for me to get my bus back inside. What do I carry? Well, something very important to me is a lighter, and something that I am frequently losing now. At the minute, I got one of these little cheap disposable lighters, but the lighter I normally carry would be this one. And the reason it's not in my EDC at the minute is it's run out of um, gas. There you go. It needs some fuel to it. And I'm not a crackhead, although this is a crackhead pipe, and that's what you'd use to light your pookie. Um, as you can see, I've got a very little bit of gas left in there. Um, but I use this because 
during the winter it's easier to light with gloves on and it's flame resistant if you have to smoke outside in Canada during the winter months and snowstorms minus 30 minus 20 whatever then this is a, an easier alternative than trying to flick this and get this to light which is pretty useless in cold weather unlike this and the other purpose is that goodness let's hope you never would have to but becomes a close quarters weapon um, and if you were being attacked and somebody had hold of your throat or maybe dragged you you know grabbed hold of your jacket or something and was pushing you up against the wall and you had this in your pocket and you got it close enough to their face or dare I say their eyes I'm pretty sure they would relinquish their grip pretty soon so that's another reason why it kind of doubles up as not only lighter but some kind of a weapon if you need to and i think there is actually a way that you can bitch this to make the the flame a little bit um longer so that normally would be the the thing that i carry and i will get some fuel so um to fill that up soon and the other thing are my smokes my cigarettes and these are a cheap brand you get in canada and look there's a picture of a lady that discourage you from smoking so i'm not going to show you what's inside because i don't think you're allowed to and the other thing that's tucked in the back there are my rolling papers and as i am in canada the other something that is legal here is marijuana and you must realize by now i do like to smoke marijuana and here is a small amount that i carry that's enough to get me through my day from leaving the house and returning and dare I say if I ever have the overnight I've got enough to, to see me through till the morning. Um, another little thing I had here is something I picked up at the Dollarama is a little tiny flashlight and you know it's not very bright but it's thin flat tucks in nicely in the side. Um, there is a little pouch in the back there where I keep my phone but I'm actually using my phone at the minute to record this. And the other thing, and as you can see, I really do use my weed bag is for moldy, moldy purposes. And what I have in here is my emergency phone kit. So what I have, if I can get into it, are just the basics. I have a charger cable, I have an adapter, and I have my headphones in case I ever want to listen to music. It looks like I've lost a ear part somewhere, maybe... I'll find that later. But that's normally what's in there. So I'm going to just put the charger back in now and we'll figure out what's going on with the headphones. Um, that's the thing I'm referring to that I've lost. It's disappeared. So we won't put those back in. Um, maybe it's somewhere. But that's that. And the last thing that's in the main compartment are my keys. And again, these are a very important thing to have. Um, my little B for Vendetta and that's my door key and I don't have a car or anything like that exciting so just my door to get um, key to get in the front door and the last thing here I have a little little side pouch at the back and what I keep in here is my main one and it's kind of a tight fit it's gonna be usually close to my body so no one can get in behind it and all I keep in there is my driver's license and a few bucks just in case of emergencies so that's my edc nothing very exciting nothing very um exotic or thought provoking dare i say it's just the essential stuff to get me to and from work and make sure i've got some smokes and a little bit of weed in my pocket in case i need it who knows when you're going to need your weed and your smokes and a, a lighter so you know, it's one of those kind of things that I'm making this video maybe to poke for a little bit of fun at the, the, the kind of prepper types that have a bag for every occasion, a little bit like the, um, that I need to go to the bathroom bag. But the other purpose is that I keep all these things in my bag and I keep this by my coat or by my shoes where, where I'm, I'm going to be leaving for the day or putting my shoes on to go out. And I know that I can grab this bag and everything I need is going to be in there. The only thing I kind of may have to, to, to grab is my phone. But I keep all these items in my bag at all times, ready to go. Um, and that way I don't forget anything on my way to work, which some people can do. And I'm pretty sure at some point in time, everybody's left their keys or their smokes or a lighter behind and it's made for a bit of a shitty day and the other thing i have like say is a flashlight so 
when I'm opening the door, I can see what I can do. Nothing major, nothing exciting, as we said. So that was my EDC. This was another ship video production from the thrift store prepper.